recording. All right, we have got two big Temu hauls today. Temu, Timu. I heard somebody say Temu yesterday. Mm -hmm. I think it's Temu, but I say Temu. I don't know. No, I say Timu. Anyway, <clears throat> we got a lot of stuff. We got some today and we got some yesterday. So um, the first thing I'll start with is this. My wife got an embroidery hoop. It's wooden. Looks like every other one I've ever seen before. It was $1.68. It's adjustable. And it's adjustable. This probably was not a great deal. Um, the lint roller, like now that I think about it, we could have got one at Dollar Tree for a buck twenty-five. We paid a dollar sixty-eight for this, but it was a, uh, hey, we need a lint roller and we're on to move, so we got one. But I would say Dollar Tree is probably your better bet for this one. Um, but it'll, I'm sure it's fine. There's nothing wrong with it. It's not overly cheap or anything like that. It's just a dollar sixty-eight versus a dollar twenty-five. <clears throat> what are these? These are the period underwear. Oh, yeah. So, my wife got her and our daughter the period underwear. Um, they were $3.39. These must be, we kind of went on the premise that everything is smaller when we order. So, we've been tr like ordering a size up. And Ann just pretty sure that these are too big. <laughs> so um, we may have to send them back, but they're, I, I don't know, they seem nice. Um, I don't have anything to compare it to, we, but it looks like there's protection where it needs to be protection and they're comfortable, they, they're yeah. soft, there's nothing scratchy in them. So they just must run true to size. Um, so, you know, if you're gonna try them. And for $3.39 a pair, I don't know what the period underwear runs normally, but I'm sure they're not $3.39 a pair. I really honestly don't know. So, oh, this we haven't taken out. This was, this was probably a, yeah, we really don't need that purchase. It was $3.39. And I'm gonna go ahead and take it out because we haven't taken it out yet. The material is, um, it feels kind of burlappy. That's right. Um, like a, a thin burlap. Um, but it's an apron. Yeah, I'll try it on. She's gonna try it on for you. So it's, you know, the material isn't like a soft cotton or anything like that. Um, do I think it's functional? Probably. Um, you'll have to stand in front of the camera. I don't know that I would wear it for cooking. Maybe I would. What are you going to wear it for? Serving? Serving me? Yes. <laughs> yes. I mean, I don't know. I guess I can't see the video because I'm not behind it, but it fits nice. Um, and the picture's great. It feels great. It's not, like, offensive or anything. No. I just don't know... How long it'll hold up. I don't... I don't know. Yeah. I guess but I'll it was, have to test it out. It? What did I say? But it's was? cute. And it'll look nice hanging on our new magnetic hooks that we got from Temu last week. Which we were very happy with, by the way. Oh, this is a purchase that did not need to be made, but I have a little bit of a gnome obsession because butches can like gnomes too. And this guy was $4.89 and we love our dogs. And it says home is where the dogs are. So that's our little gnome that we're gonna add to our ever expanding collection. Not a necessary purchase, but whatever. Uh, it's another pair of period underwear, right? Yes, that, those are the ones I ordered for Haley, but... You will talk about it all. Now, these ones will fit me, and we have to get her a new pair. This was seven thirty-eight, and we got this for our 
wheelchair van because our daughter sits in the back in her wheelchair and there's absolutely nothing to put anything in. Like she can't have a drink or anything like that because she would have to hold it. So, oh, this is pretty sturdy. This goes on the back of the, of the uh, seat. So she'll have a place to put a drink and her phone if she wants to set it there. And again, this was 738. That's pretty nice. That's pretty sturdy. I'm pretty impressed with that. It's one of the most expensive things we've purchased. Yeah, definitely one of the most expensive things we purchased. Uh, let's see what we got here. Oh, this. Okay. All right. Seriously, this was an unnecessary purchase. But I saw it. And I was having a moment. And it was $6.48. I'm going to go ahead and say... It was probably not worth it, but it's a, a wooden coffee mug. Super lightweight. Like it feels like balsa wood lightweight. Is that how you say it? Balsa? Uh -huh. um, but I don't, it's not, it doesn't bend or break. It doesn't feel like it's, it, it just was an impulse purchase that I really didn't need. But we got one of the cool bags with it, so. But I'm not going to send it back. I'm still going to drink a Breve from it and see how that goes. Let's see. Oh, I got a new watch band. Um, it was $2.69. I haven't tried it on yet, but uh, it's for my Apple Watch. So they had a huge selection of them. Tons of them. Is that one stretchy? No, I don't think so. I mean, I can take it out of the package. Oh, it is stretchy. Well, you know. So it is stretchy. I did not know that. I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, I guess it's okay. But it was $269. Uh, let's see. Oh, just a, a three-prong USB charger. It was $1.29. Um, I guess it's not really three-prong, a three-port charger. For a buck twenty nine, you can't beat that. So what's a Christmas and what's not? We have some Christmas presents in here too. So um, I don't want to. That's Christmas and so is that. That's what I thought. So that's what I thought. Let's see. What's this? This is like Christmas, man. And we just looked at these. <laughs> um, <laughs> this was a buck twenty nine. Ange has been ordering these. She does a lot of crafts and craft shows and stuff like that. And so I really don't know why she ordered these. Tell me what they are. It's though. the uh, newsprint. Well, honestly, I thought they were going to be bigger. So they're. But I'll use them for magnets or keychains. Or if I can find two duplicate. They're cool. I mean. Or two similar um, little ads on there. I might make a pair of earrings or maybe a necklace. I'll figure so, something out. She thought they were bigger. That is not the smallest thing we got <laughs> though. We will get to that in the next haul because these are practically ginormo compared to <laughs> stuff we got from our other haul, which was kind of comical. Again, cool. But just, you know, not not the size we thought they were. This bag is like never ending. I know. Oh, another Especially thing that we, we probably didn't need. This was 69 cents. And I don't care for 69 cents. A little, like we want to do some freezer meals with um, breakfast sandwiches. And so, you know, things wrap up better if your egg is in a a round shape on the English muffin. So we and got I, that. It seems I fairly had a decent. I one that didn't work because it wasn't sturdy enough. So the egg seeped underneath. And I know you can use a canning ring, but then you have to pick up the canning ring and that shit's hot. So this has a handle. Yep. And so 
Maybe we didn't need it, but it was 69 cents. I will appreciate it if it works. This was a dollar 48. And I think Angie's going to put this on her embroidery chest thing. What do you call it? Embroidery box. It says peace, love and sunshine. A buck 48. Wow. Pretty nice quality. Again, smaller than what we thought it was going to be, but and I don't think I was supposed to see this. It's the I love you more. No, you did. We oh, talked okay. about it the other night, remember? She got me a keychain. Like, you know, we do that stupid, I love you, no, I love you more. You know, you know, disgusting people who do that. So she got me this keychain that says, I love you more, the end I win. It was eight. Pretty nice quality. Um, Not at all bendy, so... Again, did we need it? Yeah. We're not sure how we ended up with this, but it was two ninety eight, and I think Angie's going to use it for her phone when she does, um, like we have recipes and stuff like that. But it's a desktop phone holder. Somehow it works. Do you know how it works? Yes, oh, there that's we go. Exactly it. And then there's a little thing that flips down yeah why don't you show them oh there we go and then this part swivels oh yeah and so like is, if you're on pinterest this is kind of padded it's not like i don't think it's like non-stick but it would probably stick to most phone cases and then there's this little relatively sturdy kind of shelf comes with these sticky uh, non-stick pads that fit in perfectly carved out spaces so that will eliminate um, the crap that gets stuck around the edges of the stickers for $2.98 so that was pretty good Oh my gosh, we got so much stuff, honey. <laughs> I know. These were a necessary purchase, and I don't care what anybody says. We have, my wife, we were gifted a great number of old canning jars. Um, and my wife put our spices in them, because I, I don't want to can with them just because they're old and they look cool. So we got these chalk labels for two sixty nine. I think there's a hundred labels, uh, hundred fifty labels, um, so that you could write on chalk paper and then put them on the jars. So I am down with that purchase. I think that was a good purchase. This I don't know what this is. Oh, oh, again, my wife makes handmade things, and these are like just blank tags. I'm going to probably put a business card type front um, and we'll also double as a price tag. These were $1.48 and it does probably say in Chinese how many are in here, but it does not say in English. They're nine centimeters by 5.4 centimeters. I can tell you that. It looks to me like there's maybe 150 in here. It's at least 100. Yeah, for sure. Oh, definitely 100. Um, 150, maybe 200. So those were a, a the necessary app. purchase. Yeah, I could probably see on the app. Oh, this is cool. And we needed this too. It's a silicone um, hot handler. We have uh, cast iron uh, pans. And so they get hot when you cook with them. And so you can slide this guy on there and pull off your pan. So that was a buck 79. So, and it's very durable. I think that's a great, that was a good purchase. They were all good purchases. What all is in here? What's this? There's no price on this. Oh, 
That's why I don't know what this is because it's like drill bit things. What are they? Damage screw removal Damage bits. Damage screw removal bits. And they were three seventy eight. I have no idea if that was a good price or a bad price because I truly don't know what how to use them. I just know that I oftentimes have damaged screws that I can't get out. And so I needed that. Yes. Um, there are six of them in here. Upon taking a closer look, when they were delivered, I realized that I actually have some very similar bits in my multi-bit case. Um, so yeah, there's that. So here's another example. These are great. Like visually, these are, they're really cool. Um, and the first one up is super detailed for as tiny as they are. Let's see if I can get this close enough so that you can see that you two can see the uterus. Yes. Okay. I mean, it's kind of, if you went a little bit to this way, ah, right there. Oh, oh, right there. Oh, right there. There we go. Yep. They are super detailed anatomy pictures. Um, again, Ange got this for crafting. I think they'll make, they would make an amazing magnets or something, <coughs> but there's another one. And it's like, I don't know if all body parts are represented here, but there's an eyeball. Um, there's lungs, there's a heart. Um, it's just really cool. A pelvis, three different uteri, three different uteruses. They were like, Pack these up, send them to the lesbian <laughs> when they got that order. I don't know what I did with the box that they came in. Um, they came in a bag, I believe. Oh, maybe. I'm going to send them right here for now. It's that little tiny bag over next to you. Guess what? That is haul one. Now this we got today. Can you give me that little bag? Yep. Oh yeah, there it is. Okay, so we will start with this. This is probably the most expensive purchase in here today at $4.59. And this is really cute. It's a honey pot. Um, we have a big jug of honey that we were gifted and this has a little drip cup and then you just squeeze your honey out. Kind of like a batter squeezer thing and then set it in the drip cup. So I thought that was pretty cool. This was actually sold out for a while. Then it came back in. There were actually, there were two prices on it. One was for nine something and I found one just like it for the four 59 and I I got that one um, and then it came back and it was sold out and then it came back in stock so that's the cool thing they're super good about letting you know when stuff comes back in stock watch it they'll pop it back in your cart <laughs> so make sure you still want it but they'll send you a, a text a message and say you know um, your item came back in you know blah 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 so about a year or two ago, I really got into diamond painting and then I kind of got out of it, but I think I want to get back into it again and I'm going to have to now because I've <laughs> ordered like four of them. So this is the first one. It was four forty eight, and I'll take it out so you can see how big it is. So do I want to do that? Um, make sure you have the one, the right one. Yeah, I do. Okay. I want to kind of show you how big this is. These are not 448 at Michael's or the evil Hobby Lobby. We don't go there because they're evil. Um, but I love canning. It's so pretty in person and I love flowers. Yeah. Can you see it? Oh, sorry. I was looking at the actual, yes. So that was pretty cool, I thought, for four, what did I say, four? 448, I think you said. I've always wanted to be cool. Oh, my watch is talking to us. 
I've always wanted to be cool, it said. Um, what'd I do with it? Oh, there it is. 448. I'm going to give this to you. All right. Um, we'll go on to something else because I've got more diamond paintings in here. Trust me. These are pretty cool. These are fridge liners for your shelves on your fridge. We got four pieces for $3.98 and they feel like um, they're a pretty heavy plastic, you know, that you can take out and clean to help keep your fridge clean. Hopefully, that is the hope. Um, oh, my! this was a buck 18. This is a denture cup. Apparently you can't find these anywhere now. Um, and they don't give them to you when you get dentures. Like seriously. Yeah, so I this is pretty big. $500 for my dentures and no denture cup. I got a new toothbrush. It's got a little slotted tray in there. You know, put your solution, I guess, whatever you put in there. So a buck 18 and it couldn't be found anywhere else because we looked, trust me. So. Well, Amazon had them. Oh. But they were certainly not a buck 18. Okay, Amazon apparently did have them. But we didn't buy them, so. Uh, this haul today, we have a lot of jewelry. Um, because I enjoy jewelry, but I don't enjoy spending money on some things. Jewelry happens to be one of them. Um, and so most of the jewelry that I own has been gifted to me over the years. Um, but this time I went crazy because I can justify spending, you might be able to see it better if you put your hand behind it, but I can justify getting a pair of earrings for a dollar and a quarter. Yeah. And these were actually, these were 71 cents. And these are heavy duty. Uh, they're not like, it's not plastic. Um, it's got a nice hook. I don't know what cents. these types of earring hooks are called, but anyway, so I went crazy, crazy, crazy. She did go a little bit crazy. And I there are a couple of Christmas gifts in there. Well, they're not in the bag. I yeah. took them out already, but again, the same reason. Her. This was 71 cents as well. Or these, I guess they're a pair of earrings. See if I can get them out. Okay. This is weird. I don't know how these go, but. Yep. You can't really see the color detail, but there are little stones inside of each of the wings. Oh, there are. These are. Oh, another, another nice hook. Really nice hook that they've used. Really good quality. I mean, I'm not obviously a real good judge of jewelry because I don't own a bunch of it, but as far as earrings go. Now she does. They're, they seem like they're going to be durable, um, but lightweight, not something that's gonna be really heavy on my ear. These were a dollar fifty two. I think these are cute. I mean, I wouldn't. I'm not saying I would wear them, but I think they're cute. And I don't know how to get in the package. And I really want to show you these. There should be. A... There's not. Oh. Can you cut them? Yeah, we'll go on to something else, and I'll have her cut. Them. Oh, they're all like this. Honey, it's on the bottom. Oh, is it? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Okay. This is a dollar fifty-two, and these are both different. They're a set of earrings, but I want to show you each one. Um, I don't know. You'd have to be like really close. 
Well, if we can't get it, we can't get it. I probably shouldn't have moved it because it took me so long to get it settled the first time. That's probably about as good as well, it's what they go. are. <laughs> I'll just explain them to you. They're very cute. I think, is it a dandelion? Yes. It's a dandelion together and then the like dandelion petals in the breeze. So they're very cute for $1.52. This is not, I should let her do this part. You're doing fine. Cause this is not my thing, but. But you're doing fine. Okay, we'll go with that. Another. You know what you like to see on my ears. Yeah. Another 71 cent object. And I think this is the ankle bracelet. Yes. And it actually is two bracelets. I guess they're meant to be worn together because that's the way it shows in the picture. But and I have fat ankles, like super this fat is stretchy. ankles. And I've never had an ankle bracelet that I've actually been able to wear without putting an extension on it. You want to And come that show it? No. this bracelet, that's fine. You can see it. That this bracelet will be. I don't know. I can't do that. I can't. Anyways, it's a little daisy. It's cute. But. If I didn't think it was cute, I would not say it was cute. So. It's definitely going to be big enough to fit my big boned ankles. And the other one is stretchy. So they're perfect. Again, 71 cents. <clears throat> Oh, the dog just got crazy. Because it's bouncing a basketball. Oh, kids next door are playing. This one doesn't have it. Oh, no. Zip it. This one does not have a... These were $1.79, and I'll just show you one of these. Oh. These are daisies, and the other one looks just like it. Those are sunflowers. Oh, I'm sorry, sunflowers. <laughs> I knew that too. Oh. These just have a standard um, hook, like most, um, I don't say most, but I don't remember what they're called. They're, but it's just a regular hook, not a real long one, so it shouldn't poke me in the back of my head. This the one. detail is incredible for, and the quality is really incredible for what we paid. I know because I've made jewelry before, and I certainly have never been able to sell any of my jewelry for 71 cents. Yeah, which makes me stop and think about yeah, people that are, that are assembling this. You know, um, you know, I got to, I don't know, you know, human rights comes into question and all that kind of stuff, you know, is, is, is this a sustainable venture that's helping people all the way around? I, I don't know about that, but, um, anyway, on that happy note, this is, this was a dollar 48 and it's a ring know if you can see that um not yet. a little bit better that way it's a dragonfly uh the way it looks is it looks like one of those spoon rings that's made from the end of a spoon there we go um but it is actually all just one piece um which is i was a little worried about it at first because again to go with my fat ankles not fat i'm sorry thick ankles I also have some very thick hands, fingers, um, so I was a little worried, but it fits great on my thumb. And then this one here that I paid, I don't have the, where did that go? Oh, $1.07 for the one I just handed you. Oh, I thought you handed me this. I'm sorry, I messed up. 
I thought she handed me the same ring back. You did not. No, it's on my finger. Oh, it's Sorry. on your finger. This is a, it's a sunflower. sunflower. <laughs> Stock and flower. I don't know if you can see it. Um, Back it up just a smidge. No, not really. It's okay. really a tiny picture of a sunflower, but if you are face to face with it, it has really, really good detail. It's very cute. All right, and seems like good quality. Don't know if it'll turn my fingers any kind of color, but this is not jewelry, but this is a thimble thing that's adjustable because my wife mentioned her thick fingers. <laughs> and so she said thimbles, she has a hard time getting thimbles to fit her. So we got this little guy. Yep. It reminds me of something that I've seen um, in a in the Silence of the Lambs movie. I think it looks like medieval armor. Also that. But it was 78 cents for a, a thimble. And she does a lot of sewing, so. And I think you can probably get thimbles relatively inexpensively. I've never actually looked at them at the fabric store just because I've always been like, no, I don't need one because they're not going to fit me. But um, either way, 76 cents and I didn't have to leave my house. So this is a shaver holder for 79 cents. That's pretty self-explanatory. I mean, some of this stuff you just can't find or you, you find and it's you a uh, four pack for two ninety five or something. You know, no, I need one shaver holder for 79 cents. So, and this, Or you don't think you, you don't know you need it until you see it. True, <laughs> that happens a lot. So these were, we were chuckling over these. These are these were two thirty nine. Again, thinking that they were bigger than what they actually were. Get them out of the box here. It it doesn't take away from the detail. I mean, it's they're still very very mm -hmm. cool. Um, but they're I don't know what hundred pieces of paper. You can just see a few of them here. I don't know what I'll make. I'll make magnets or something with them. Um, They're all, the design is, is actually incredible. I look at this one. Yeah. And the detail is, it, it's really incredible. They're just smaller than what, which is thought. okay actually, because then I don't have to cut anything, you know, but we learned that people do junk journaling, but that's a huge thing. So don't worry, we did not look that up and get involved in that yet. I said, yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah. when we do, we'll have some supplies. We're down to our last two items, believe it or not. This is one of those, what do they call them? A uh, redactor. A redactor. It's, we have like a ton of magazines that we we're gonna donate. Um, but they have our address on them and this guy just you roll it over and it makes your address or your phone number or whatever information you know whatever government documents you're trying to hide it it's a uh, it just says private on there and then confidential all over it so you can't read it um, that was what I say 89 cents yeah, 89 cents. And last but not least. Oh no, I lied. We got a couple of other diamond paintings here. I showed this one, didn't I? The daffodils or the, the dandelions. No, but that's the only other one you can show. Oh, yeah. One of them I can't show because it's a Christmas present. It's really cute, though. Take my word for it. Mm -hmm. This one was three forty eight. I feel like there was one more, too. It's down on the floor. Oh, is it? I thought, though. I thought I got four of them. When the hell I'm going to have time to do that, I don't know. But So let's see how big this guy is. 
for $3.48. They're a bit of a bitch to get out of the bag. I can tell you that. There we go. This is exactly what you would find at Michael's, though. Um, not huge. Pretty small. But the quality is it's good. It's upside down. Is it upside down? Yeah. Okay, sorry about that. <laughs> is that better? Yes. And then you got your drills. And your pen and your tray. So, and I think I have one more. Where'd you say it was? On the floor. Back on the couch. Ah. One more diamond painting. This one, it, it looks like it's really small. Um, if I can figure out how to open it. Oh, this one's sealed. No, it isn't. No, just like all the other ones. This one was 219. Like, that's just unheard of. I don't know if you've ever done diamond paintings before, but that's pretty cheap. You know, I did, the first one I did was like a little tiny, tiny, tiny one that I think we paid more for that than we did for these. Mm -hmm. This is actually probably going to be a little difficult. It's pretty small. Oh, wow, they really made that look a lot bigger in the picture. Yeah, they did make it look bigger in the it, picture, I will say it that. Been had, it, they must have had that over Barbie furniture but, or American doll furniture or yeah. something. Yeah, but it was, it was 219 I mean, you know, it is what it is, like but a nice it's still thing. a nice little, yeah, a nice little, it's 20 by 20 centimeters. <laughs> That's where they get you. Everything is in centimeters. Um, You know, and then the pictures they, they show are... Are a little misleading i'm not gonna lie um they do look bigger <laughs> than than what they are but you know i'm still happy with it um i don't i'm trying to think if we've gotten anything that we're not happy with oh my shoes oh i'm not i'm not not happy with them i just don't know that they were worth the Twenty nine sixty nine. I paid for them. They look cool, um, but they're not leather. Um, you know, the sole is pretty. You can bend them like this. Um, they're very lightweight. I will say that, but they feel. Uh, I'm not. I'm just not sure. I, I'm not sure. I do like how they look, though. So. That's, this is the most expensive thing we've bought by far. I forgot about those. Yeah, I, I forgot about them too. Um, I'll have to wear them and see how I like them, but I like the little tree on there. I don't know if you can see that. A little bit, yeah. Um, and I like the color, but. And she likes shoes. And I do like shoes. I do. So that's it. That's our Temu, Timu, Temu haul, two hauls. And I'm telling you, we sign up for 30% off. Like, everybody has an account in our family. So go get your discount code before you shop. Um, definitely worth it with the 30% off. There's mm -hmm. just no question. Um, the quality is better than Wish, for sure. Um, Several of the items we've purchased have are for Christmas presents. Right. And so if we consider that in what we've spent then right and we have bought some stuff just to buy it but you know it is what it is so that's it um good luck have fun be safe out there in timu land because it is very addictive so all right all right thank you bye friends